Hey folks, what's up? Welcome back to another Palm Mass video, and boy did I have a great morning. If you guys follow me on Twitter, you've probably seen this already. Uh, but, you know, usually when I wake up, first thing I do, open up my, you know, game and, and check the eggs, right? That, that I put there overnight, and uh, I hatched them. And yesterday I got Quaxley, which is uh, a slight disappointment. Nothing against Quaxley, it's just the tech Quaxley is not very good. But I did get the shiny Quaxley, and, and, and this morning, uh, I, I got two shinies in one patch, right? I got the shiny Sprigatito and the shiny Fuyukoko. And, and now I got one of each shiny, right? One, one of each Pokemon. Not of each roll, though, so, um, you know. It would be nice if you get, like, all nine. Because it's because this, you know, Paldea egg event, right? It's it's all of them, right? Like, all like all three of them. And and each of them, obviously, is all the other Eggmons, right? Striker support and, and and tech, but all nine of those have shiny versions. <laughs> so all the you know tech support, strikers, Sprigatitos, they all have shinies, right? And all three of them are shiny. So yeah, <laughs> um, but I'm content because I think I got the best one in terms of like value wise, right? Which is uh, this one, the support Sprigatito, right? Um, this one's amazing, right, in terms of just value-wise for, like, a free-to-play unit, right? Obviously, you know, it's still an Eggmon. I mean, it still has, like, some issues, like, Eggmon support. The defenses are not that good, right? Speed's pretty bad, blah, 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 all that. But in terms of just, like, you know, as a free unit that could give you grassy terrain, hello? <laughs> free grassy terrain unit? That's a W in my, that's a pretty big W in my book, right? Free grassy terrain unit. That's that's no joke. I think that's that's pretty freaking amazing that they they gave us that, and it's a support grassy terrain unit, right? So all the supports are kind of the same. Um, Sprigatito gives uh, grassy terrain. Fuyukoko gives uh, you know has sunny day, and then uh, Quaxley has rain dance. Which you know the other two are great too. Don't get me wrong. The other those to those two are great. Again, free sunny day, free rain dance unit. Great, great, great. Uh, it's just that grassy terrain is just not as available as the other two in comparison. So um, I thought that was amazing, and also. Like, if you look at, like, the grass terrain units that we have so far, like, uh, for, like, in terms of, like, the main ones, right? It's, um, it's Celebi and, and, uh, and a Leafeon, right? Uh, Adamant's Leafeon. And they're both physical, so having a special support grassy terrain unit is just kind of, you know, it's special. It, 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 it is special. Um, even though, again, grass types are mostly physical, right? Grass types in this game, they're mostly physical. Strong ones are mostly physical. Oh, there are some special ones, right? And, uh... You know, like Gardenia, very underrated, I think, right? Uh, Brendan, obviously, Leaf Storm, uh, you know, stuff like Groudon or or even ho the free one, Solar Beam, right? They're, those are really, really strong options as well. So, you know, we got that. I think Lodge Sycamore, also a special, right, <laughs> grass-type unit. So, so you know, there, there, are, there, there are some, right? It's just that, again, physical is more dominant. So, you know, in the future, if they do drop more special, you know, grass-type damage dealers, this good being nice right so yeah in terms of like the the rest of the kit it does also give you speed which is cool right especially if you're i mean speed is good in general but you know uh if you're running it with like brendan right to get inertia running speed all that stuff it helps a bit there um so that's nice uh and as for the passives it does have healthy healing so that helps it stay alive a bit more i guess uh first aid two same thing there and then turbo turf gives more gauges and grass here and that's great right so um, we'll, we'll go through, we'll, we'll try out all three, but let's let's just do Sprigatito over here first. So let's run it. 2.5k mass mode. So with Sprigatito, let's just start buffing. Shall Brandon we? still has to do his thing, though, just because his sink is physical, right? He, he needs physical attack there. So let's do that. Um, let's maybe just Grassy Terrain turn two. We just it's have Groudon start attacking. No. Right? You know, just start spamming like, solar beings, whatever. And yeah, the, the actually debuffs are tough, right? Because... You know, Leaf Storm is not, not a, not a perfect accuracy move, right? Um, oh, oh no, I don't have the grid with the extra crit buff for a route on. Uh, should I go? Yeah, let's, let's, let's get it in. Hopefully we take out the Swampert there, because, uh, you know, that'll give us an extra turn, which could be helpful, right? Uh, well, not could be helpful, definitely will be helpful. So please crit the side, uh, the left side at least. Crit the There's left no side in the middle. I don't really me. care that much if we don't crit the right side. It would be nice if we crit them all, but you know, I'm trying I'm trying to be realistic here. <laughs> okay, but we do, we do. So 
Yay, I guess. <laughs> All right. Let's uh, yeah, reset Grassy Terrain over here real quick and um, get a bit more speed for the team. And we got that. At least Groudon's still critting, so. <laughs> and we haven't been missing our Leaf Storms. All right, because, uh, you know, it's, what, I can minus one X or something? Uh, Hydro Pump, does that mean we, we've taken out the mid? Really? Or, I don't know what's going on. Yeah, I was like, I don't think that's enough to take out the mid. <laughs> like, like I know they're, they're, they're powerful, but like, I don't know about that, man. Okay, um, it looks like Sun's going down. Ooh, Sun's gone, so that, that's tough for Solar Beam, right? But at least uh, we do have our sync up in a bit. Hopefully that Solar Beam doesn't miss. Ooh, Grass Beam gone too. But it should be enough, I'm thinking, right? Yep, Solar Beam hit, and uh, should we just... Oh, Mighty Water. Ah, oh, man, that's so close. Uh, dude, I, I should just press this, please. Oh, no, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Yeah, I got the sink in. And yeah, even though unfortunately our our, our little um no our little shiny me. cat did not survive till the end, but it did its job. It did its job. That you know, without the extra damage boost from Grassy Terrain, uh, we pr probably wouldn't have <laughs> cleared it over here, right? So, um, good good job, good job, Sprigatito. That was very 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 very, very nice. So uh, b before before we go check out the other ones, just a quick overview, right? For those um. We don't know yet the other Sprigatito forms the tech one is tech one's all right um it has like bite three percent chance of flinch right and with a uh, aggravation so six percent chance of flinch that's honestly pretty good as well right that's definitely really really nice and gauntlet and got move gauge refresh too there as well um you know x speed get some speed for your team and so it's basically it's kind of like a budget nanu right it's kind of like a budget nanu over here and the striker, I believe, is like a leaf storm. Yeah, leaf storm unit, right? Leaf storm unit, um, you know, speed crit, and dauntless, dauntless leaf storm unit. So <laughs> that's really, really nice, right? So um, yeah, there's that double down is kind of, I mean, you're, are you? I don't, I don't think you're really sinking. But I mean, I, you can, <laughs> just not, you know, anything crazy. Uh, but yeah, like the, the the striker version is is basically the same as like the striker version for Fuyu Coco over here, right? Same thing, except uh, Fuyu Coco overheat, which we're gonna check out over here, right? He's just like overheat and overheat dauntless, and also again same pinpoint entry double down, right? Just to max out that accuracy for for uh, overheat and leaf storm since they're 90% accuracy moves. Everything else is the same, uh, and then like just Ember versus um, uh, what was the other one? Energy Ball, right? Uh, yeah, so <laughs> do you have an opinion on Ember versus Energy Ball? Uh, I mean, I could form one if you want. Let's see. <sighs> Ember versus, uh, well, Ember costs one less gauge. 10% chance to burn. Energy Ball, 10% chance to debuff special defense. I'd say in most case scenarios, Future. Go. Energy Ball's better. <laughs> okay. Here we go. So, um, let's, uh, let's, let's, let's try this out. Uh, they, Cobalion tries to come let's in, go. debuff our, um, debuff our accuracy but uh, does not work like that does not like work like that over here because of dauntless <laughs> right i mean the other two got their special attack Let's debuffed go. but not 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 for not for our, our goat over here Fu coco um yeah so uh we'll get that in um do we need to get another racy win not really just because, like, Co Leave already it maxed me. it out. But, I mean, I did it anyway, so. <laughs> All right, let's get the sink in first. And after that, let's stun Spore. Um, we'll get uh, Sun in, and we'll, you know, and, and we'll start cooking, I guess. We still need one more um, crit, but, you know, it's 80% right now. And, uh, you know, one train move let's that go. would do the trick there, right? Uh, max it out, so. Uh, okay, let's go. That's pretty good for an Eggmon, right? Again, Eggmon, no, no, no grid, no, all that stuff, right? Bad stats. Actually, what is his? What's this guy's stats again for, um, for, like, max affinity and all that stuff? Uh, we need to, we need to for them, but they're gonna sink here anyway, so let's, let's sub them slightly, cook here a bit with their sink. And, all right, let's see, um, so 150, because Eggmon, you don't, you know, yeah, Eggmon just straight up goes 150, right? I don't have potential there. Let's see, affinity level. Um, okay, can we, wow. 
Hey man, that was <laughs> healthy advantage. Whoops, forgot to uh, forgot to sink there. Um, I mean, again, I sink. Well, we'll sink with them just because like our other unit is like Vile Plume, so not that Vile Plume's a bad nuke. Vile Plume's a great nuke, but might as well sink with Fu Coco. It is Fu Coco, you know. Partially his video, yeah, a third of it is. So okay. Uh, let's see, what's the stats here at max affinity? 360. Ah, it's, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> that was actually not bad, um, sync wise. Again, I, I expected less, man. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, I'm, I was expecting less. <laughs> but, uh, that's, that's, that's good to see at least. That's good to see. Alright, let's, uh, let's get the stun for in here again. I um, might have to potion him real quick over here first. Let's see, let's get that. Go in. Let's uh, let's 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 not sun until later, just cause like we're almost on our sink anyway, so it's it's, it's kind of too late <laughs> right now. <laughs> um, for for the sink cycle, right? Um, or at least like this half of the HP bar. Uh, whatever you wanna mark is like the halfway point here. Let's see if we could get this in half and then. Yeah, that's half, right? Okay, you know what? Let's go. Okay, let's let's get Sunny Day here just to get like Sunny Day plus like the sink just to see how well that is cuz he does have a 20% multiplier on it. <laughs> Double down, right? So <laughs> Yeah, like this is this is a this is an overheat unit that you could just run um Yeah, you you, you just run crit strike 2 on because again, dauntless in the grid. Right? That's a weird sick move pose, but okay. I mean, it's it's wow. Hey, uh, Eggmon? Eggmon? I get. I, I do have. I. It is a high investment on Eggmon, right? Because it's like, it's five star. It's um, it's uh, you know, I think max affinity. It's either max affinity or at least at like three, without the extra um, twenty out of twenty there. But you know, still pretty good. Still pretty good, right? I mean. With Eggmon, we, we, you know, let's be real, we have low expectations. That was pretty darn good, man. 18k there on the on the regular overheat move, right? Yeah. Wow. Um, I don't know. I'm pretty impressed. <laughs> so, yeah. It's a, it's solid, man. It's solid, right? It's, it's definitely solid. Um, again, overheat itself is a, you know, relatively high BB move. Uh, I do think I gave him 5 out of 5, right? Just because, like... The Eggmon candy, like, there's so m many, and, like, there's not much use for it anyways, because there's no like, grids for them, so just use them. Yeah, like, you know, overheat for a 3-gauge move, that's pretty high BP, so... Yeah, I don't think we crit there. Yeah, we didn't crit there at the end, unfortunately, with that sink, but... Still, honestly, it was, it's pretty darn good. It was pretty darn good for, a, for an Eggmon, even though, again, like, uh, Fire-type damage healer Eggmons, I'm pretty sure, like, we have... A, 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 you know some solid ones right um actually no i don't think we do never mind i take that back yeah because like like fire type damage healing eggmons right like we have um uh what is like like rapid ash is like flare blitz with like not enough stand stand fast or no stand fast at all oh my god okay that's terrible then i remember one of them oh okay i, I he has stand fast then i think right um magmar is an overheat unit right it, it's it's overheat but it doesn't have dauntless right it has crit strike one instead which i mean it's crit strike one but on the other hand you'd much rather have like dauntless on the passive and then you could so you could lucky skill crit strike two right that's super duper effective one there as well but you know that doesn't apply to the sink so i guess fear coco wins on this one right and also i believe it's the sink is physical oh no 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 oh, no it's special that's fire fire punch so yeah also has zero special attack buffs itself and then, like, the other one's, what, Charizard? I think Charizard was all right, if I remember correctly. Yeah, it wasn't bad, like, Fire Blast, right? Yeah, like, Charizard's all right, but... Oh, yeah! Wait, 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 wait. No, it's this one, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh yeah, Power Reserve is super... Oh, okay, yeah, the passes are pretty bad, but... I mean, Fire Blast is just a... It's, it's, it's a solid move, right? Um, it, does that have Pinpoint Entry? Oh, it doesn't? Okay, so we need to actually boss for him. Yeah, so I mean, he might be like the best uh, fire type, <laughs> you know, striker Eggmon, right? So as, as for the other, as for the other ones, right? For uh, for Fio Coco over here, right? You have um, 
uh, what the, the the support and tech the support one I like I mentioned for it's sunny day right it's sunny day with uh, let's brainstorm and dar hit all so this is really 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 nice too if you get this right Sunday unit that could buff crit and um, special attack and speed and uh, passives are, are pretty much yeah similar right it's being sun first to healthy healing and then the other one is uh, the the tech one which gives you X speed and fire fang and then you get a hostile environment to an aggravation two on on fire fang just hoping for that like, burn and flinch uh, this one's not that good I feel like right so yeah I guess <laughs> anyways um tech speaking of tech our, our last one the uh, the tech quaxley that I got yesterday um, I'm, I'm sorry to inform you is just straight up bad uh, it's the worst of all nine of them I don't <laughs> yeah it's it's just it's not good man it's 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 thing is it's like like a gauge ish unit which I mean it's it's an egg mon like 336 speed is not bad right it's definitely not terrible but you know it's not anything great either like i don't i didn't 20 out of 20 it but i guess if 20 out of 20 it's like 356 which is you know that's that's nice but outside of that it's like you got x speed which by the way the trainer move doesn't even buff speed further so you don't max speed out it's like you you're stuck at plus four speed and then like your moves out you water gun and growl which are two one gauge moves which are nice but like that's the only thing it does outside of speed and gauges is growl minus one physical attack that's it <laughs> again the training move gives defenses and gradual healing which i mean uh, to be fair i didn't give it like inf affinity but like even if you do give it like max affinity <laughs> max affinity max like the these are not these are these are not tanking numbers like these are not yeah it's just it's sad it's sad um i, I, don't, I don't know say so, like passive wise got move gauge refresh stamina reserve and hey so that's just like yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> the other Quaxleys are, are, are much better. Not, not again. Not to hate on Quaxley, but uh, anyways, let's uh, let's try to get a run in here. Let's uh, let's fight Ante, and let's do let's do double double Water Eggmon over here, right? With the help of um, uh, Sing Su Chris. <laughs> but again, he, he just he just doesn't do too much. But you know, in, in this um, scenario, oh, I forgot. I I got the tech. Gyarados, and you just uh, swap in the striker one. All right, fix that. Also, thanks to the the, the second Magikarp uh, event, I actually finally got a shiny striker Gyarados now. So <laughs> that's uh, that's very very neat. All right, that's that's pretty cool. Okay, so uh, let's get this going again. It's nice with this Gyarados because you know Gyarados Hyper Beam unit, right? I mean. Yeah, it's a type of beam. So, uh, the gauges are definitely gonna be helpful. Right, definitely, definitely gonna be, gonna be very much appreciated. Just the gauges, right? So, um, let's see. I, I guess we'll, just, we'll get one in now. Uh, fire spin. We don't have much there, but I mean, we have Sing Su Chris. So, like, who really cares? To be honest. <laughs> right? Like, yeah. Okay. Um. Plus this big Gyarados, so. Alright, let's get the sink in. We get one MP back, at least. Right? Uh, like that thing, the, the MP back with Sing Super is so nice, man. So you don't feel guilty for using like a rain dance uh, earlier just to use it just to get the extra special move up next on you know with your training move, right? So let's see. I guess we'll we'll growl. <laughs> You know, all right. Look, we're gonna stack up as many um, special move up next as we can, and then at the end we'll just give it like a one big water gun, okay? <laughs> one big water gun, folks. Cause look, hey, we have we have max special attack, we've got max crit from Chris, so yeah. I mean, I guess it would be a better example if we, uh, you know, we had someone who could uh, uh, use the physical attack downs which off the top of my head I don't really remember anyone like water that, that uses any multipliers with that but I mean if there are it's I, I, it's not, it, I would think so. it could be that big of a deal but here we go folks plus five a special move up next water gun <laughs> unless Gyarados does too damn uh, too much damage and then like rain and then like sun comes back then that would slightly suck but um, no, no, yeah, because like his sink isn't that great, right? Because almost 2,000 damage. <laughs> uh, obviously, he's not damageless, so like that's not even like the main point of, of why you know this 
unit's not that great. It's, again, like, he just doesn't do much, right? Like, he gives you some speed, which is good. Better than nothing, but, like, that's, like, the bare minimum. Like, unless they just design a unit that completely cannot tank, does not support, doesn't do good damage, and, like, actively decreases your team speed or something like okay then th okay maybe there's like a unit that just straight up just is a net negative on your team right so he's still a net positive but it's just like in terms of like ha having him there versus you're just gonna like 2v1 a stage or whatever <laughs> right still better to have an him in there but like it's just yeah it doesn't help that much but um but yeah the, the other ones are nice though the other ones are nice um, he has uh, the, the striker version, um, piercing gaze and super duper effective one with hydro pump, right? So that's that's always going to be nice. A hydro pump that can never miss. And uh, the same, you know, stat buffing stuff. And then the support, again, it's rain over here with, uh, with so Sprigatito, buff special attack. Um, well, mainly the, you know, special attack. And then if you goes credit, then he gets speed. So that's pretty nice, right? Um, obviously, all three of those are pretty useful. So. Uh, yeah, and then Racing Rain, First Aid 2, the, all the other stuff is, is, is the same. But anyways, yeah, uh, good luck opening up these, uh, opening up, hatching these eggs, because they are definitely very nice, right? If you get the right ones, so, you know, just not this tech quackly, so. Uh, again, in my opinion, I feel like the best ones are the sports, right? But, uh, you know, the strikers aren't too bad either, and I feel like Tex Brigatito's not bad, right? Tex Brigatito definitely pretty useful in... In, uh, in doing long gauntlet streaks, but the other two, uh, especially Quaxley, may, 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 maybe not the best <laughs> unit to uh, ever hatch from uh, from an egg, but anyways. Uh, but yeah, they're shiny at least, and uh, hopefully, you know, in the future we get their evolution as well, but, um, you know, at the moment, at the moment we can't really evolve them, but uh, it'll, it'll, it'll happen in the future. It's just, might just take a while, but we'll see. All right, so yeah, uh, yeah, that's uh, that's me with this one. Hope you all enjoy guys in the comments down below. Um, like enjoy the videos for my channel some more poem as content. Let me know what uh, what which one of these shinies, if any, guys hashed it or just got completely shafted and uh, you know can't even get like a three passive one out. So uh, even if you don't get the shinies, like uh, three passive support, you know, either of them would be nice. So alright, see you guys.